Hey everyone, so if you're in the Web3 space, you know that communication is, well, it's a mess. Most of it happens on Telegram and that can get chaotic fast. Today, we're gonna take a look at a really interesting new tool called Charm CRM. It's built from the ground up to bring some serious order to that chaos and it does it with AI. All right, so here's what we're gonna cover. First, we'll dig into the problem, that communication chaos in Web3. Then we'll introduce Charm and see how it's designed to fix it. After that, the fun part, we'll see its AI co-pilot in action, look at how it automates workflows, and then talk about the bigger vision for the future. Okay, so let's just start with the chaos itself. I mean, if you've ever tried to manage any kind of serious business relationship in Web3, you know Telegram is pretty much where it all happens. But the thing is, it's a tool that creates just as many problems as it solves. Does this look at all familiar to you? Yeah, that's the feeling of juggling dozens, maybe hundreds of important conversations and potential deals in an app that was really just built for casual chats, not for professional business. It honestly feels like you're just trying to keep your head above water sometimes. And in the real world, this means you're fighting this daily battle, right? You're managing multiple accounts, conversations are just slipping through the cracks, and you can't even review a message without letting the other person know you've seen it. That immediately puts you on the back foot. Team collaboration becomes a nightmare, and trying to scale any kind of personal outreach? Forget it. It's almost impossible. And here's the most important part. This isn't just a minor annoyance. This chaos translates directly into lost leads, missed opportunities, and it puts a hard ceiling on your ability to grow your operations. It literally costs you money. So this is where Charm CRM comes into the picture. It's a solution that was designed from the ground up specifically for how Web3 communication actually works, blending what humans are good at with these really powerful AI agents. You know, the name itself is kind of clever. Charm actually stands for charm, which represents this partnership between humans and AI. The whole idea is to create a workflow that isn't just effective, but is actually simple and elegant to use. It's all built on a few really solid principles. First, you get one unified inbox for all your accounts. Second, and this is cool, a stealth mode that lets you read messages without sending that read receipt, which is a huge strategic advantage. Third, it keeps a permanent record of every interaction. And finally, the engine that powers the whole thing, a deeply integrated AI copilot. So let's talk about this AI copilot, because this is where things get really interesting. What makes it different from, say, a standard chatbot? Well, the key thing is, it doesn't just tell you what to do, it actually does it for you. So picture this, you start your day and you just ask the CRM in plain English, hey, find unanswered chats from today from the Platinum C1 account. No clicking through menus, no building some complicated search. You just ask. And here's the magic. Instead of spitting back instructions, the Charm AI instantly takes control of the user interface for you. It sets the account filter, it changes the date to today, and it turns on the unanswered status. It just does the work, no clicks needed. This slide shows the difference perfectly. A normal chatbot gives you a wall of text instructions, right? But Charm's AI is actually connected to the interface itself. So when it says, here's the unread filter, you can literally hover your mouse over those words in the chat and the actual button on the screen lights up. It shows you, it teaches you, and it acts for you. It's a totally different experience. So this makes it a true co-pilot. It gets what you're saying, even if you have typos. It can explain any feature on the screen. It can control the interface to get work done. You can use your voice and you can instantly find anyone with a simple at mention. It's incredibly intuitive. Okay, so how does this amazing AI co-pilot actually translate into real world efficiency? Let's look at how it takes these key business workflows that are normally super manual and just automates them. So take their gatekeeper feature. Instead of a manager having to manually approve every single person who wants to join a private group, an AI agent just takes over. It starts a conversation, it asks qualifying questions, it analyzes the answers, and even auto-tags the person as a founder or a VC, and then it decides whether to approve them, deny them, or flag them for you to look at. The whole process is handled automatically. Or how about making introductions? Another super tedious task that's now automated. The system helps you find the perfect two people to connect based on their profiles, and then it does all the heavy lifting. It creates the group, it adds the contacts, and it even drafts a personalized intro message. Your only job is to give it a quick look and clip create. That's it. 
And the impact of this is just huge. I mean, this one feature alone can make that critical task of connecting people up to 10 times faster than doing it the old manual way in Telegram. 10 times. And this automation is everywhere across the platform. The AI helps with everything from smart tag management and communicating with leads, all the way to scheduling calls and even analyzing the results of your newsletter campaigns. It's fully baked in. Now, the co-pilot we've seen is incredibly impressive, but it's really just the beginning. The long-term vision here is to evolve from a helpful assistant to a full team of autonomous agents that can manage entire business functions on their own. We're talking about a future where these agents are proactively managing your entire pipeline. Imagine an agent that starts your day with a summary of exactly what you need to focus on, or another that's analyzing campaign replies to find the best leads, or one that drafts your follow-up emails after a call. The idea is to stop assigning little tasks and start assigning entire business processes. So what does this all mean for the future of doing business in Web3? Well, this is the much larger opportunity that's worth paying really close attention to. What makes Charm so compelling is that it's attacking a massive, very real problem with completely unique technology, that interface-aware AI. And it's not just a tool. It has a clear, scalable vision to completely redefine what a CRM can even be, moving it from a passive database to an active, autonomous partner. You can really feel the sense of massive, untapped potential here. The foundation they've built is powerful, but it's obvious the creators believe they've only just scratched the surface. The message is clear. The creative possibilities are endless, and this project is right at that turning point, ready to just explode. So, the question Charm CRM is really asking all of us is this. Are we ready for a future where our most important business relationships are managed and even nurtured by intelligent AI agents? Thanks for tuning into this explainer. We're definitely excited to see what comes next in this space.